Hello there and welcome back to Achala's Closet. How are you today? Hope you are having a great day. If you are new to the channel, welcome. My name is Achala and here on Achala's Closet, we talk personal style and just how to look and feel your best at any budget. And um, speaking of budgets, as always, you know, one of the questions I always get asked is, where did I get that from? Or where did you buy that? And um, so I thought, since we are in my closet, how about I show you guys everything I have in my closet, um, all the brands that I have. So I'm going to do videos for you guys, just showing you everything I ever bought from a store. So for example, everything I ever bought at H&M or anything I ever bought from Aldo, La Chateau, you name it, every single brand that's in my wardrobe, you will see them in a video. Um, and then I'm actually super excited to show you guys some of my favorite pieces that I picked up here and there. And to kickstart this, I just thought, why don't I start this with one of my favorite things in the whole world and also one of my favorite stores to go to and find one of my favorite things and that is shoes and um, so when it comes to shoes I literally shop everywhere from Hudson's Bay to Aldo to College Spring um, you name them one of my favorite ones is MDX at Marlboro Mall I will show you guys all of my pieces from MDX in the next couple of videos but for today I want to talk College Spring because you know I'm obsessed with them. Um, I found College Spring back in 2008, and ever since I always go in and I find things. And um, it's not even just about design, and like you, they have a lot of designs, interesting pieces, but again, yet classic pieces that you can wear for years. Um, also, their prices, honestly, you can beat College Spring prices. One of the reasons I love College Spring is for the prices, especially during the sales season, you can literally get a beautiful pair of shoes for just under 20 bucks. And I mean, talk about budget, right? Um, but you know, it is just one of my favorite stores to go to. And um, if you don't know what Call It Spring is, it is a Canadian retailer. It is a shoe store that caters both for men and women. Um, they also sell a little bit of accessories, like come winter time, they will have scarves and hats, and then they have necklaces, earrings, sunglasses, a little bit of hats here and there. Um, but they are known for shoes and bags <laughs> so that's one of the major things they're known for and you can find them literally in any canadian mall and it is actually aldo's um aldo sister founded by the same guy with that being said let's just jump right into the video so the first things that i want to show you guys is this necklace right here now this one is very old i think i picked it up late 2000s or there maybe almost 10 years ago i swear to you um but it is just a multi-color layered necklace that i really love every time i wear this people always compliments and ask where it's from so this is definitely one of my favorite purchases ever from Call It Spring. Um, moving along to the second item. I know, right? It is this sparkly, yeah, sparkles. <laughs> sparkly clutch over here. Again, this one, I bought it a long time ago. <laughs> everything here is a little bit old so I'm gonna try and remember how old they are but this one here is really very old I just love this design right here where you just slip your fingers in to hold the clutch 
It is, if I'm not mistaken, it is probably a knockoff of um, Alexander McQueen uh, clutches because McQueen does a lot of those clutches with the skull and everything as well. You can see it right there. Yeah. And um, that's actually my favorite thing about the clutch. And the color is just beautiful. And I've been using it for the last 10 years, you know, whenever I can. And um, moving along with bags, another one of my favorite. Now this one here took me a long time to find. Um, I think I've seen the picture of it on Pinterest. And um, so I went into this whole um, search. Turnout, College Spring had them, but then none of the stores in Calgary actually has one in store. I had to go in the store and had the associate order me one, and that is my camera clutch. I know it's so cute. It's like gold with black detail is just amazing i cannot tell you how much i love this thing um price i think was under 30 dollars honestly i think it was like 25 26 dollars and it also comes with um cross body strap that's somewhere in my closet um but so you can hold it as a clutch which is one of my favorite things or you can just put the um, crossbody strap and kind of just use it as a crossbody can be the issues i'm going to start with the super old one and that is this baby right here now this one is one of the first pair of shoes i've ever bought at college spring and um, that will be back in 2008, so just about 12 years old. And she's still in great shape. Um, I bought this and also I have this beautiful strappy black one. I'll post a picture on the side here so you can see it. I purchased them on the same day and it literally for the both of them cost me about $32 not kidding um the black one i wore it a lot more than this silver one here only because it seems to be more of an evening shoes but every now and then i pop it on with some white jeans or black jeans and a nice blazer and t-shirt yeah. another one of my favorite from call it spring and it is my summer staple. This shoes, I wear it all summer long. It is about three years old now. Yeah, just about three, four years old. And it is this multi strap sandals here with a little bit of a thicker high heel, of course. Love it. Super comfortable. Every summer, I wear the hell out of this shoes it is the sexy thing here again come summertime i wear the life out of the shoes now this one here was a christmas gift from my boyfriend i think four christmases ago <laughs> yeah about four christmases ago now but um you know i just i love the color i don't have that I don't have many things in this color and maybe that's why I love this color so much and just a little cut out detail open toe super sexy ties in the front but you also have a zipper on the back just to make it easy slip your foot in and out of this gorgeous baby here now this one here I bought one about seven years ago, wore the life out of it, got messed up. So one time I went to, I think Value Village, no, or Woman in Need, 
and I found they had these shoes in the store and I cannot tell you how excited I was. I just wanted to replace the super old one that I had and so it was kind of nice to just find the same shoes and this time in my size because the first time I bought it I think I had to go half a size down because they didn't have my size but still I wore the life out of that shoes so one of my favorite staples is this nude pump right here next is this beautiful blue and white baby right here with I know right such a beautiful heel now this one here too is one of my favorite ones come summertime I wear them with my straight leg white pants white on white or um, I'll share a picture here as well as just showing you guys how I wore this a couple of summers ago but um it is also one of my favorite ones next one of course is this snake I know multicolored here it's got some pink lots of blue a little bit of gray with black and it literally feels it feels like it looks okay <laughs> um, but yes this one here I just love it again come summertime one of my staple pieces or sometimes when it's really nice outside not snowing purple platform high heel here now this one I used to wear it a lot but in the last couple of years not so much maybe once in a while not sure why but I still I love it and I love the color and maybe that's why it's still in my closet this, this gorgeous burgundy strappy platform <laughs> shoes right here now this one here again I love it so much I had to go half size smaller it's a little bit snug but you know fashion is pain <laughs> at least that's what I think and um, so I still wear it um, most of the time just during summer because you know for a pop of color or like an all black outfit or just a simple summer dress blue and black one here this one too is very old um, probably maybe eight nine years old I'm not sure but it is just it's so beautiful like just the heel design I love it and that's why I can't I I just I cannot get rid of the shoes I have my rain boot I, think I got it last year or the, yeah just last winter and um, again I just love it I wear it sometimes during winter I know it's snowy and all but with some thick wool socks or a thermal socks it's perfect for the weather again it's got great grip at the bottom so you don't have to worry about slipping or any of that nonsense Another black booty now this one also was a gift from um, my boyfriend's brother um, they didn't have my size so I had to downsize just cuz I love them so much <laughs> um, again it's got an elastic band on the back here just to make it feel comfortable it is a little bit of a lower chunky heel which is kind of nice now this one here again I wear it a lot is my sock boot now I cannot tell you how much I love 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 the sock boots um, it's super comfortable I decided to go with the burgundy I think I bought it about two years ago almost three years ago actually I decided to go with the burgundy just because you know I love the color burgundy and I have um, 
one of those pleather pens also in burgundy and every time I put them together it almost looks like just one piece <laughs> you know um, but no I honestly love this and they are so comfortable I can literally wear this for an entire day and I've worn it for an entire day at work before a couple of times last but not least of course is my above the knee boots now this one here I picked it up over the summer and it cost me just about $35 $30 and um, it has it is one of my favorite boots to be quite honest with you this is probably the only above the knee boots that's flat and I wanted a flat one for so long and I just I didn't want to spend all that money on a designer flat shoes and so this one here was just again didn't have my size so I had to go half a size down but I still love it I can wear it with socks to work um, and it still fits so it comes with a little zipper here just to make it easy to slip in and out of them. Also has a string on the top. And the pleather is not as soft as the, um, you know, the uh, full suede ones. Those ones just slip off your feet. Whereas this one here does not. You put it on, it stays up. That is it. I can't tell you honestly how much I love that store. And I'm super excited to show you everything I have in my closet and um, just to make it easier moving forward, you know, so when we add new things, we know these are new things and whatnot. But um, that brings us to the end of the video. If you like this kind of video, give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to hit the subscribe button and um, turn on your bell notification so you get notified every time a video is uploaded. Um, but before I go, the winner for our bow tie from the last video is Rebecca Mund. So Miss Rebecca, I will make sure this bow tie gets to you. Thank you all so much and um, I will see you very soon.